Hi Upload, I'm Ensa Boss and I'm here with Eric's today. We're here to give you another Titanfall beta breakdown. We've already covered the basics to help you get started in Titanfall and we've also taken a look at the various modes. But today we're going to take a look at the two maps available. And we're going to get started with Angel City. Now this is a medium sized map set in a futuristic city with lots of tall buildings, tight alleyways and blind corners. Now the layout makes it ideal for close quarters combat, but the elevated rooftops do provide plenty of line of sight for snipers. Now when playing as a titan in this level, it's quite dangerous as you're forced to use the main streets. This can often result in your getting trapped. Given that this is a close quarters map, you're going to want to think really carefully about your weapon loadouts. This map is perfect for the R97 compact SMG, the EVA 8 shotgun or even the smart pistol MK5 as they are really great for close range encounters. The blind corners on this map often result in surprise encounters and therefore a weapon with a high fire rate like the SMG or higher close range damage such as the shotgun are perfect. If close range isn't your thing and sniping is more for you, then I recommend switching to the AOG scope as it's better suited to mid range encounters. The other thing you want to bear in mind when thinking about your loadout is your tactical ability. There are two available to you, Stim and Cloak. Cloak allows you to go invisible for a short period of time and Stim will allow you to sprint a lot faster again for a short period of time. Cloak is especially useful on this level given the tight corners and the obstructed view provided by the buildings and it allows you to hide from enemies and often get the drop on them. Next up we have Fracture. Now this is a medium to large sized map set in a derelict fuel depot on a barren landscape. The layout makes this a much more long range encounter map. And there are some great elevated spots for snipers to both shoot from and hide in. This map is especially great for titan combat as it's so open and really allows you to display your mech dominance. Being a large map, this is where you are going to want to think about your long range setups. The Longbow DMR Sniper is the obvious choice on this map given its long range of sight. However, the R101C Carbine is also perfect as it's a great balance between both long and mid range. With a decent fire rate, it'll allow you to hold your own in some of the tighter buildings, but it'll also allow you to pick off some of those pesky snipers at range. I'd also recommend using the Stim Tactical Ability as the speed boost will allow you to cross the map quicker and avoid being out in the open too long. This probably goes without saying, but if you're sniping on this map, then the longer range scopes work much better. Personally, I prefer the 4.5x zoom rather than the 6x zoom, but that's up to you. Well, that's it for this video. Hopefully you found it helpful or learned something new. And if you've missed any of our other beta breakdowns, then be sure to follow the official Upload Gamer tag and add us as a friend so you know when all the new videos get uploaded. And speaking of new videos, next up we're going to take a look at some of the weapons in Titanfall, so make sure you stay tuned for that. I'm Ensa Boss, and that was Eric's. We'll see you next time.